let's say I wanted to identify as an alien. Do you mm. think I could get a? Do you think I could identify as an alien? Well, people marry trees and things nowadays, well, don't they? What, what kind of alien? Well, it doesn't like let's just say, let's say I <laughs> would you wanted, be green uh, with yeah, an antenna. That's, exactly, that's it. I just with green antenna, you know, and I just wanted to identify as an alien. Do you think I could actually identify as that? I think we're in would, this would I day be able and to do age. That? Yeah, I think you'd you have a lot of weird green. stares. But do you, would you yeah, think? Yeah, if you, if, do you think I, I could actually become another species? What, as in like legally? What, with, with legally. <sighs> No. Because no, why? Well, because you're still human, right? They say it's biological. Yeah. Oh, but then again, then there is that but crossover. Then there, there are people. There's one yeah. percent of our DNA is actually not from this, of this earth. <laughs> why don't we test it? It's <laughs> true. <laughs> I'm but this is you're true. One percent of our DNA is not of this earth, and I'm, and I'm not trying to trivialise it. I'm just trying to understand, you know, where where where, does it and, end? And where would people accept me and how I'd want to identify? Do you know what I mean? Well, if this is something you've contemplated for a while, we will accept you. There you go. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> there there are two people in this world that will accept you as an alien. So go for it. So when you in so sorry when you interviewed <laughs> oh, God, in sorry, your Alex. last job, so <laughs> yeah. when you interviewed in your last job, mm. um, you met Alex the first your interview, and you knew. So you weren't thinking about a job. You're like, wow. I've just met love my life I honestly had a group chat and I left the room and I messaged a group chat I was like right girls get you ready now <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was like I found him I found him they're like what are you on about I was like oh the, I don't know like this guy just interviewed me um, yeah I don't care about the job anymore obviously I'm joking this woman she done an article for the New York Times and she actually went and um, cracked on on Tinder yeah yeah so she was like you know meeting on Tinder and then she basically met met uh, a, a geezer um went to a hotel room, did the business, hmm. and then... Um, you know this for sure, do you? <laughs> yeah, there's no Friends with them. <laughs> and, 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 and then uh, did the business, and then yeah. she said, like, when she got up, she turned around and, and looked, 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 looked over, and the guy was just back on Tinder again. <gasps> just, See, stuff like so, that. So he was just looking, wow. for his, looking for his next victim. That's actually what I, I heard on the Joe Rogan show the other day. So, wow. Yeah. Yes. So I was on Tinder for a while, and, and I, I'd been in a long, long-term relationship, right? So I'd never, never experienced it. But I actually found it to be so boring and so hollow. <laughs> like the, mm. you know, the the way the conversations just like if you if you just say one thing wrong, it's like done. Or if yeah. they say one thing wrong, you're like, nah, I'll move yeah. on. Yeah. To be fair, I think I had it for like four you know days. I, mean? I had it for it's... like four days, and there was I honestly was like, <laughs> I was too scared to talk to people. I was like, I'm not messaging anybody, or you know, like, and if they messaged me, fascinated by. I feel like some of the shit that people would send to you, write to you. Yeah, pictures, it was just I'm, so I'm, weird. I'm dying was... to see what like the responses from girls get on Tinder. Should like, we have a look at sort of Tinder fails? Well. Should we have a look and see what's <laughs> going on out there? I was literally like, and if someone messaged me, I I just got so like guys will say some fucking. <laughs> I was like, I'm not replying to that. Like no. I'm horny. Hi, horny. I'm Emily. Smooth. <laughs> Hello, you're hot. No, I'm Emily. That's all right. <laughs> Joey, do you know what my Johnston and microbiology... Do you know what my Johnston and microbiology have in common? They're both hard for you. <laughs> <laughs> I need a microscope. <laughs> <laughs> do you run track? Um, yeah. No, why? Because you must relay want my dick. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Fair enough. I'm unwell. This is terrible. What if you're really looking for love, innit? And you're like, I'm just so sick of these dick pics. Just so sick of these <laughs> dick pics coming my way. Mm, you just ignore it then, don't you, really? Uh, anyway, here's another one. Fuck me. I can't tell if you're expressing anger or if you're actually requesting sex. LOL. Want to hang? <laughs> <laughs> Each negative four has a uh, momentum of... Uh, it will start a momentum after 17 seconds. So you've got 17 seconds to stop the momentum of that thought, otherwise it starts to exacerbate, yeah? yeah. So let's so once you then once you stop it, you're great. So as soon as you think of a negative thought, <clears throat> as soon as a negative thought comes your way, then think of a positive thought and then it counteracts it, right? You know that train in inception that like goes through the city? That's how sometimes my negative thoughts tend to end up. <laughs> and I don't check that shit out. Exactly, but I ride the train. I do. But the point is, again, uh, but then when you when you say you've gone you're far too gone. Say you've gone yeah. like you're you're now in, in ten minutes of negative thought, yeah. Because that is now because that is deep the shit. emotions create the feeling. No, sorry, the emotions create the thoughts, and the thoughts create the feelings, and then it's just a fucking vicious cycle, right? Mm. Let's say you're in that in that space. 
then um, the the best thing you could do is just just like it's like ride it out. just ride it out. Just yeah. hang on, and it'll be over soon. It's like it's like if you fall out of a plane, you know, you haven't got a parachute. Just hang on, it'll be over soon. <laughs> <laughs> Mum was like, "See, like the universe isn't against you, Molly. Like there's there's nothing against you. No, Things you will work out eventually. You exactly. Are the, how are you, you, the universe is not separate from you. You are. We are. We are. This is." This right now is the universe. Maybe I like to think someone's looking down at least. I always say someone looking down at me, you know. No, you are, you're you're your God. That's the thing. You are your own God. You are your own God. I am my own God. And you are creating (laughs) everything around you. Yes. You are the universe. You're not separate from life. You are life. Life is now. Well, it's present. That's what I try. And I do a lot of reading on present day. (laughs) (laughs) You need another beer now, Linus. There you go. Have have, have that one. Um, And... And that's the thing. <laughs> and he is. <laughs> so, so, so you're saying who is against me? It's yourself. Ooh. And and often we just need to get the fuck out of our own way. Like, get out of your own way. You just got back home. You really need a piss. You run to the door and you're like, get your keys out. Can't find your keys. Exactly. You, you, you're trying to. You, usually, you can pull your keys out of your pocket like yeah. nobody's business. Yeah. yeah. But you're pulling. You're fucking getting them stuck. And you can't get them at the bottom of your bag. And then you're trying to put them in, you can't put the keyhole, key in the keyhole, you're just like... <laughs> you and it's the wrong key. And it's the wrong key, usually it's fine. But yeah. it's because you're in your own way. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? And you're, you're flustering yourself. You know, and you watch like a scary film or something, and I always just think to myself, if anything happens, you know, and they're trying to run through the door, and they can't get the keys in, <laughs> and someone's behind them like, oh my God, I'm like... Or when they, that or when they go to start the nervous. engine, and they drop the key. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, that never happens in real life, I know. No, it would happen, it would happen, trust me. They get, they're in their own way. Get out of your own way. <laughs> <laughs> He's coming to get you. Fucking murderer. 